The LG K20 is one of the least expensive Android smartphones available. This low-cost handset features basics such as a 5.3-inch 720p screen that is quite low and Android Nougat 7.0 operating system. Things that set it apart include a good fingerprint reader and excellent battery life. The K20's front face is nearly all black. The display hides within the frame well, meaning the really thick bezels are more or less invisible when the screen is off. With no home button or fingerprint sensor on the bottom, LG certainly could have cut down the bezels a bit, but that likely would have driven up the phone's cost. The earpiece speaker is the most noticeable aspect of the phone's forehead, thanks to the metal grille. As mentioned, there are no physical buttons. Instead, LG uses on-screen controls, so the glass is interrupted from top to bottom. It also features a 5-megapixel front-facing camera and a metallic trim around the device. On the back of the phone, you'll find a 13-megapixel autofocus camera, a flash, and a fast fingerprint sensor. This phone's camera is reminiscent of its bigger brother, the LG K30. In fact, both smartphones take pretty similar pictures, often noisy in detail, quite cool colors, and a little brightened. The sharpness suffers in low light. You can use the camera for snapshots, but if you want to enlarge and print your pictures, you should look elsewhere. Videos can be recorded in 720p and 30fps, whereby this is an artificial restriction of the LG software. With other camera apps, full HD videos can also be recorded. The autofocus here is a bit slow, and brightness transitions are clearly visible. Overall, the video quality is okay for the price range. Wondering about sound? The LG K20 has a decent speaker located at the back of the smartphone. It barely radiates deep mid-range frequencies, but still has quite balanced highs. Nevertheless, some of the frequencies are quite unpleasant in the ears. Vocals and speech seem quite thin. When it comes to aesthetics, the LG K20 has a nice rubber coating to it. When you open up the back, the LG K20 has a 2800 milliamp hour removable battery that can provide you up to a full day of use with light use. When it comes to memory, one gigabyte RAM isn't much, but not unusual in this price range. Only the Xiaomi Redmi 7A offers more at this price. The 16 gigabyte mass memory also corresponds to the average class, whereby the Nokia 2.1 comes to the customer with only eight gigabytes. A dedicated micro SD slot can be used in addition to the two SIM slots. Thus, the memory can be expanded by up to 32 gigabytes, whereby our reference card Toshiba Xeria Pro M501 with 64 gigabytes is also recognized without difficulty. The WLAN module is a bit slower than many competitors, but the differences are very small, and the LG K20 offers a quite stable signal overall.